The Senate has resolved to approve special funding for the nation's security services to tackle challenges of insecurity across the country. This resolution was arrived at after members of the upper house met with security chiefs behind closed doors today. The session focused on the proliferation of dangerous firearms and the spate of killings by terrorists and kidnappings by hoodlums across the country. The security chiefs, led by the Chief of Defense Staff, General Abayomi Olunishaki, agreed to bring the request for special funding to the Senate in two weeks. Members of the upper house also agreed to fast-track bills or protocols that would help tackle insecurity across the country. The Senate, in a closed committee of the whole, received briefs from the Chief of Defense Staff, the Director General of the Department of State, State Services, representatives of the Comptroller General of Immigration, Inspector General of Police, Comptroller General of Customs, on the proliferation of dangerous arms, spat of killings by terrorists, kidnapping by hoodlums across the country. Thereafter, they answered questions from distinguished senators bordering the security insurgents, terrorism, kidnapping, and other top national security matters. And on the whole, we decided, directed that on our part, certain outstanding bills or protocols that needed to be given a fast, fast track should be addressed immediately to see that they can be passed as soon as possible in order to strengthen security architecture. Secondly, of course, we all observe the funding issue and we also agree that there must be a made special funding uh, so to give them two weeks for which to present their own budget on this area of special funding that we think will go a long way to improve the security situation in the country.